So, hi. This is the Dali BMS. One of the best on the market. Uh, low cost. Low cost. It's not very low cost. This, uh, this one costs about uh, 40 bucks. And this is four cells. And this is uh, for a lithium phosphate battery. This model. Now I'm going to save you a lot of time and I will explain why and what to do because I spent over a week to make it work. Okay, <clears throat> so why first don't buy it not from official uh, store. Anyway, I bought and I had problems and I, why, I will explain. I got this UART dongle and I got this Bluetooth dongle, okay? So this is not the official dongle and this is not the official dongle. Of course, I, I open it and try to configure and understand the driver under Windows 10 is not working and I tried many things and also open it, there is a chip but no number on the chip so you you don't know what is the driver of this one so this is a garbage about the bluetooth this is not the official bluetooth eventually this is working but again look it is not isolated i wouldn't recommend it so do not buy on aliexpress a uh, other store than the official dali store this is my recommendation because it is maybe cheaper but it took me one week to make it work and this was not easy so first of all this dongle can work on android and also on iphone and the official it probably the, the board inside is like the official but this is you see this is uh, not a very good uh, quality build not isolated doesn't have a, a box a plastic case so not recommend to buy from the sellers that uh, sold for me so first in order to make it work the bluetooth uh, you need this is this is one of the things that i'm going to save you a lot of time after connecting everything you need to charge it start charging and just then the bluetooth work sound uh, i don't know sound <laughs> not reasonable but this is how it is you need to start to charge and just then it will supply voltage to the bluetooth unbelievable i don't know why they did it like this other things uh, this is a very smart one you can control many things for example you can calibrate the voltage of the a total battery the discharge the charge current so you can calibrate everything if you have a, a good power supply and it is recommended to calibrate it and it's very easy process to do so if it is working so if you go to the site do not download all you the things that you see because eventually none of them is working you need to download a software that is called Sino Wealth BMS tool. This is the only one that is working. The, the PC DALI BMS doesn't work for this one. Also the BMS doesn't work. Also the manual is not very helpful so it will not help you at all. So what I did eventually in order to make it work, by the way, you, you can change the setting from the PC or you can change it also from the phone when you are connected. And uh, so what I use, I, I just uh, stitch as FTDI instead of these garbage that I saw, that I showed you. This is a garbage, doesn't help. So eventually I did use this one instead so uh, you just need to connect of course power and uh, ticks and rx and be careful 
this is 3.3 volt and this is not 5 volt so you need to take a model that you can use 3.3 volt and not 5 now it is connected and I will show you uh, how to control everything this is why I do recommend on the DALI but uh, do yourself a favor and don't buy from uh, anyone that you see and use the official store so now I will show you I will you again you can control uh, some of the feature is more uh, let's say it's more convenient to control some of them uh, from the PC uh, some you can control from both but I will show you uh, maybe on the Bluetooth so now I will show you what is nice about it by the way this is 60 amps this is a lot of current uh, the, the models that we can see now and now I will use my phone so you have a smart BMS this is uh, this application here and you go to the main screen you see the the, uh, the number that, that you get this is the connection you just press it and bang you are connected and now you have a setting here that you can change so you just press it and you can set uh, uh, the card. By the way, in, in the first uh, menu, oops, sorry about this, you can see the voltage of each of the cells. You just scroll down and you see each, uh, each one I have four cells. So you can see the voltage of each of the cells. Now, if I go to the settings, this is the, the most uh, uh, maybe one of the, the advantages of this one let me fix the focus okay so you can go and set the discharge current now it is uh, 7 amps so you can enter a number let's say I will put 5 and then set and then it asks for the password the password is 1 to 6 by the way and again you, you set it and it didn't change yet set again now you see it is changed to 5 amps and now I will show you that it does work this is the most amazing thing so I've limited instead of 60 amps on this one I've limited it for uh, limited it for 5 amps now I will show you I will connect the load hopefully nothing will explode here so you can see no current and now I will uh, start to consume current so you can see 1 amps at 5 I remind you it should disconnect 2.3 3 4 and I pop did you see now the voltage dropped to zero because it is working and it is disconnecting the current out now if you will move to zero again it will not start it will not start you need to disconnect the load I will disconnect it now and then reconnect it and then the voltage will be back to life 3.2 uh, volt now I will take uh, the application we show you and now change the current let's say to 3 amps so 3 set few times set and now it, it, it is changed to 3 amps and now there are much more settings but this is the, the most important when you're using high current uh, cells so now we are at 3 amps so I am starting to consume current so 2.4 everything is perfectly okay and now I will move to uh, 3 and you can calibrate you see 3.7 uh, 2.75 and I am a little over 3 but it is not calibrated so we'll go a little further and bang 0 
so it does work this is the, the amazing thing about this BMS things are working so eventually so you have all the settings many settings uh, you can control the cell uh, minimum voltage and you have a cell voltage low uh, voltage protect you can set it you can set the maximum charge uh, other than 3.65 if you wish you can change uh, the, the diff between the cells protection meaning when it will stop if the if the diff will be above uh, 250 vol millivolts or less so you have many things to control also from the PC you can do the same so bottom line I recommend just do yourself a favor don't buy from anyone and buy the official uh, DALI uh, this is my recommendation so uh, thank you very much and bye